Okay, today I'm gonna to make a spicy guacamole uh, with avocados, obviously. <laughs> uh, it is a superfood, and I don't like eating them on their own. <clears throat> I don't like the flavor so much, so I have mixed it up, added my little bit of spice, and now it's super, super tasty, at least for my palate. <laughs> you will need two avocados. One tomato, de-seeded and chopped up finely. Half an onion. And my green jalapeno chilies. I like using these because um, it gives a really nice flavor without adding too much heat. Half a cup of coriander. Half a lime. Some cumin seeds. About a teaspoon of garam masala some salt and tucked away is some two cloves of garlic that's all you need right i'm mashing up the avocados now avocados are now probably the best superfoods that you can eat on a daily basis because it lowers your cholesterol it lowers your blood pressure it's a good source of fiber it helps prevent uh, cataracts and macular degeneration as you get older and I guess that's because it lowers your blood pressure so the smaller arteries at the back of your eyes do not burst as you get older or weaken. Um, so avocados, eat them daily. So I mash this up, a good old mash, that's what guacamole is all about, mash it up. And then we add in the other ingredients. We've got the half the onion and the tomatoes. Now tomatoes are good for you because they contain something like something called lycopene. And I'm probably like mispronouncing that, but this also lowers your cholesterol. Uh, tomatoes also have plenty of antioxidants in them as well, so it's all anti-cancer properties in there. So really what you're making is a medicine. You, um, you are creating something that's very medicinal for you. Um, then we add my favourite, coriander. I love coriander and I looked it up to see what coriander, the uh, properties it has. But it has antioxidants in it, loads of vitamin uh, potassium, iron, so it lowers your cholesterol also. It improves your liver functions and bowel movements. So we put plenty of that in there. Then we get a lime. Oh, I'm gonna fall over myself. Get half a lime, squeeze that in. Again, that contains a citric acid. Then we get our garlic and we crush the garlic up and put that in. Now garlic, again, I looked it up. Lowers your blood pressure, lowers your cholesterol. Uh, what else? It's a very good antiviral properties in there as well. So if you've always known that garlic, if you've got a cold or a flu, to eat loads of garlic. So we crush the garlic, pop that in into our guacamole mixture. Love my garlic. Then the chilies, pop them in. Now chilies are also everything that I'm putting in here is actually very, really, really good for you. So it again, it lowers your sugar levels, it boosts your circulation because it's heating the inside of your body. Um, so we mix that in. So we're mixing it all in there for you. Then our dried spices, which is the salt, the cumin, and the garam masala. Now in Ayurvedic uh, practices, they use these uh, spice mixes to heat the body up. It increases your internal body heat, so your metabolism increases. So if you want to lose weight, pop these spices in. Also, they have lots of other benefits too. So give that a mix. There we go. Now, the chilies, chilies are really good for you because they act, they have something in it called, again, I'm having to read it, capacitin, probably pronounced it wrong, 
which acts a bit like insulin, so it actually reduces your sugar levels. So really, you can see that this bowl contains a lot of medicine. <laughs> um, so we'll give that a little mix. Now, because I put the garlic in there, you need to let this rest for about half an hour to an hour overnight. It'll taste even better for the garlic to give its flavor in there and then it will be absolutely delicious. And serve this with anything you want. And just think what you're gonna be doing to your body. Mm. I'm serving up my special spicy guacamole with a fried egg and fried bacon because I'm not eating any carbohydrates. Okay, let's get a shot of me eating this. But because I'm not having any carbohydrates in my diet, I've had to make this up. It's a guacamole, some a fried egg, and some bacon. So let's taste it with the guacamole. It looks like an egg's Benedict, my friend said, and she's right. Let's give it a go. So this is all medicinal, right? By the way. Mmm. Oh, with egg yolk with the bacon and the guacamole is just a marriage made in heaven, so they say. That is absolutely delicious. And the guacamole, because it's got all those different flavors in them, it just lifts the whole dish up. Give it a go. I've got my friend here, she's also having a plate of one of these as well. So we're just discussing the health benefits of eating something like this and why I came up with this idea and it's just purely because I was hungry and wanted something quick and no bread, no rice and actually I'm only going to keep it up for the next four days because in four days I've actually lost three pounds. I don't want to lose too much weight so I'll be back on the carbs in about four or five days and then my diet will be a bit more interesting. <laughs>